it's really about supercharging its effects with more comprehension and li a lifestyle based approach. So importantly as well, many of you are probably thinking, well, how am I going to get to change? It doesn't happen overnight, my friends. So I'm going to give you three tips right now that you can start, um, choose one, but choose the one that what I call the lowest hanging fruit. And I'm going to give you tips first on uh, focus on diet and nutrition. So number one, I do like this approach. It is something that we know in the world today that nutrition, lifestyle medicine is actually being used as a treatment for many diseases, not just as a prevention anymore. So what your child eats affects brain function and mood. So begin by reducing processed foods, doesn't have to be complicated, and introducing more whole nutrient dense foods like fruits, vegetables, healthy fats, and of course to support a healthy brain. This is like nuts and seeds, foods in their whole form. I love to share an approach that is more in the alignment of when you bring things in, it will flush the others out. It's not always about removing 